Specs and punches, I don't do the shit for fun, I do it for a large check. Hello people, so welcome to Lessons with Leka Lolas. This is lesson one, and this is a set of tutorials where I tell you how to take public transport and how to take public transport safely so that you arrive alive, especially if you live in Cape Town. So lesson one is all about how to take train. Now I take train every single day, people, and it's not as easy as it sounds. Metro fail, now it's called Metro fail, not because it's dirty and Musa and just not let go, but because it's a failing system, it never runs smoothly. There is always issues. Now that it's getting to winter, you can ask the people. It's a two hour delay, if not more, compared to a 20 minute ride that it's supposed to be. And they don't refund anything, they only refund a single and a return. Nobody gives your money back for a weekly or monthly. But anyway, some of us, we don't have a choice. We might have to take the train. You're coming from the northern suburbs, the southern suburbs, wherever, you, wherever you're coming from, we have to sometimes take the train. So I thought I'll just be that person. I'll just tell you how to. Okay, so firstly, you're gonna have to buy a ticket from the most miserable people you'll meet. They're not gonna greet you. They are cuck miserable. They really are. So you're gonna have to go buy a ticket. You get a single or a return or a weekly or a monthly. Now a single in return, that's the same price. A weekly, you save a little bit of money. Like if you've not taken the train for maybe two days, it's still cheaper to just buy a weekly for the whole week. Also, you can get on and off the train as much as you like. No one can tell you anything. With a single and a return, you can't get off the train. They're gonna take your ticket away. Or they're gonna make a scratch. Then they're gonna, you can't use the ticket again. And with a monthly, it's also cheaper if you, maybe you don't go three times a week, but you're going for the whole month, it's cheaper, okay? Then you get Metro and Metro Plus. Now, I know people, apartheid is supposed to be over, but on the trains, it's a whole other story. It's third class and first class. So Metro is third class. You get yellow plastic seats. You don't get cushions or anything. You don't get security. You're lucky if there's windows in the little square blockies. And it's very full. It's very full. Especially during peak hours. But it's cheaper and you are toch more safe. Then you get Metro Plus. That's your first class. That you get like blue cushions and you get security sometimes. It's a little bit more expensive. You do get the plastic in the windows most of the times and there's less people but you're not that safe and you're spending more money it's also where all the sturdy people want to sit so if you're looking to get robbed you can I go sit in Metro Plus anyway you must buy your ticket and your ticket will say Metro or Metro Plus now because it's cheaper you will get fined if you're sitting on liquor cushions and you pay the cheaper price People, they're going to find you. And I think it's 40 or 45 grand to find. Yes, it's like you must carry a dorm bus with you. That's how it feels. So people make sure if you're going to sit in the cheaper side that you're sitting where it says Metro. Outside the carriage, it will say Metro or Metro Plus. It may not break anything. So then you must decide are you sitting that side or that side. Metro Plus is at the back end of the train and Metro is the front end of the train. So make sure you're in the right place before they come and take you. They're going to put you in a hockey if you don't have 40 or 45 rand on you. I'm not lying. I've been in that hockey. Anyway, so once you've got your ticket and you know where you're going. So if I am taking a train from Cape Town, which is the busiest and most Yamaka station ever. No, maybe Woodstock and Salt River is worse. But if I'm taking a train from Cape Town to Retreat, I have to go and buy my ticket, then I look at the board. The board will tell me the different platforms, the different areas that the train is, the lines that the train is running on, and the time. So now I'm going to retreat. I'm going to take, maybe I'm going to take the safer line, which is the southern suburbs line, from Cape Town to Fishhook or Simonstown via Weinberg. That stops at retreat. Or I'm going to take the Cape Flats line, because via Athlone, it also stops at retreat. So then I can decide, okay, that's my, that's my two destinations, that my two lines that I'm taking, which one is coming first? 
and then make sure you're on the right platform and you're on the right train. That's the most hassle. That's the part that everybody's fun of. Am I on the right train? Am I in the right carriage? Am I going to the right place? Now, the part that I am most fun of is when I'm in the train. Now I must sit amongst somebody that's feet stink or big stink or they just sweat the rach or they all up on me. Or I'm not going to get to sit. Now I must stand under somebody's arm because I'm like a shit. People, don't act sturdy and go sit all alone. You're going to get robbed. The people are going to see, oh, she has money. She thinks she's quiet. She's all alone. Nobody's going to protect her. They're going to rob you. Go sit by somebody. Find a little uncle that's not going to try his luck with you because it happens. But the uncle that's going to protect you. Or an auntie that's going to give you a sweet, especially if you make things. Or just find a place to sit where there are people around you, not alone. And if you have to stand, don't stand close to the doors. Go stand there in between the seats. Doesn't matter if you're in the people's way. You're safe. Nobody's going to rob you around you. And you can see, okay, now I still have to get off through that window. You can see, okay, that's now Plum said I got three more stations or four more stations. Okay, that's the part that I'm most scared of. You can't exterminate in the train, people. If you're going to read your book or sit on your phone, they're going to rob you. You're not going to know where to get off. You must keep an eye, okay, but uh, my station is coming soon. And you must also keep an eye for the people around you. Don't be us. Be back. Uh, but don't be paranoid. If you sit so, where am I? Oh, where's my stuff? They're going to see, oh, she don't take train. Then they're going to mess with you. Just go sit like uh, other people. No, okay. Put your best reaching. Best resting bitch face on. I can't even be a bitch. No, I can't. Put your best resting bitch face on. And the people's not going to mess with you. Make sure you know where you're going. You've got the right ticket. You're in the right carriage. You're going to the right place. You get off. You give the people your ticket. Or if they don't take your ticket, then you can give your ticket to somebody else so that they can use it and they don't waste their money. And that's how you take the train, people. I hope this helped you. Remember, share, subscribe, like, comment, ask your advice. I'm going to answer you if I can. And remember, don't be cockna, be like